All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lucy, and today I decided that I was going to, you know, share a little bit, I guess, about myself, because a lot of people have been asking lately, where'd the name Lucy come from? So it's kind of an interesting story. So let's just jump right in. All right, so I guess it would, I guess I'd have to start with, we'd have to go back in time and do a little bit of time traveling. And we're going to go to December 31st of 1996. And this was when Battle.net was first launched by the original Blizzard Entertainment. Now, shortly a few days later, on the 3rd in January, you had Diablo, the original Diablo, launch on PC. It was, I'd say probably a little while after I had got my hands on the demo. And at the time, we had America Online. You have mail, right? That was the ISP or internet service provider at the time. And it was, I know probably everybody remembers these stupid CDs, right? That you could get from magazines and America Online had a really horrible business model, right? It, you could just get a stash of these CDs and use the 50 hours and then uninstall it and reinstall a new CD and get another 50 free hours of internet access. Uh, so uh, whatever. But anyway, even if you had the service, it didn't matter how good the quality was. That didn't change. So... America Online got a bad reputation, among other things, for also being extremely easy to disconnect or randomly just lose your connection while you're on the service. Now, this is back in the day with dial-up with the 56K modems or what I know some of you guys might remember 14.4s, you know, and then 28.6 and then 56K, right? So, ming, 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 bong, 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 right, all that crap. Anyway, when you got disconnected back then, there was no pausing and resuming a download where where you, you pause that usually unless there was some extremely fancy FTP thing put in place for you, which most companies and websites at that time did not have, where you could pause a download and come back later. And Blizzard at the time was not one of them. So what they would do is when you went to download the demo, which was 400 something gigs, I'm gigs, listen to me, it was 400 something megabytes back then, right? 400 and I want to say like 50 megabytes, 60 megabytes, something like that. And it took three days to download, okay? Three days. So that'll tell you how fast downloads used to be back then. Anyway, I played the demo, fell in love with it, whatever, whatever. Fast forward, get the game, go to create an account and everything, you know, you make your battle net and whatever, whatever. And at this time, been messing around with AOL for a while or America Online. So anyway, so I was like, man... Uh, one of the guys that I, you know, meant that we had kind of gamed a little bit with, you know, it's like this, this, this service sucks, man. It blows, you know, and so that was the name that originally came up with. It was AOL, capital AOL underscore blows, lower blows, AOL blows. That was the name that I originally used at first as my first online alias, <laughs> right? And that was the account name for Battle.net. So fast forward a little bit, okay? Um, I couldn't tell you if this was before the Blizzard Activision buyout. I really couldn't tell you when this happened. All I know is that it happened somewhere in the Diablo 2, I, I guess, when the, the first season, maybe. There wasn't seasons back then when Diablo 2 first came out. Um, I had, it was AOL Blows. I was like number 10 on the hardcore character charge. I tried to find some information to go back that far, but I couldn't. Um to show that the necromancer on hardcore he was level 98 before he he died so that sucked but anyway it was aol blows aol in the school blows that was my necromancer so something must have happened i guess or something happened terms of service whatever and they made me eventually i went to log in one day and it was for, i want to say it was for starcraft i think it happened during starcraft i think i got away with that name for a very very long time it was years before this happened so fast forward to yeah i think it was starcraft I used to make some maps and, you know, a few people download them, whatever. And again, I couldn't tell you if this before Blizzard Activision merger or when it exactly happened. But I go to log in one day and I get this little message in the middle of my screen. And it says, your username is now in violation of our terms of service. Some shit like that, right? And I'm like, what the hell? So I clicked OK and it gave me another prompt box to instantly change my name right there. So I was like, wow, so I can't use this name anymore that I've been using for years. So I decided, well, they kind of got under my skin a little bit. I'm like, well, I'm going to be the devil then. I'm going to be the devil's advocate, right? So I was like, well, let me just put Lucifer and see how that works. You know, L-U-C-C-I-F-E-R. I, I thought that's how you spelled it at the time. Keep in mind, I'm a kid. So anyway, do that. It accepts it. Boom, it goes through. 
Started using that alias Lucifer in all of the games from this moment out. World of Warcraft, um, Aeon, uh, Terra, uh, yeah, all the ones that I started playing at the time. Looking on my dashboard to see when some of the other ones, uh, uh, some of the other games that I have to install them uh, uh, back, I guess. Uh, Starcraft 2, um, Lucifer, L-U-C-C-I-F-E-R, more or less World of Warcraft. That was like all my aliases, but even some Arcage characters and some of these other games. I would have a Lucifer tune. That was kind of like my go-to name. You know, I was just not being original, but it was original, I guess, to me because I did it in every game, right? Whatever. It was just kind of something I stuck with. So as I started getting more into games and I started playing the games more and, you know, raiding like in World of Warcraft, uh, you know, PvP and whether it be arena or whatever, you know, you get in comms, you start using TeamSpeak. Uh, you know, for those of you who might remember the TeamSpeak days and you start using these other programs, you start getting into this more, um, you know, just coordinated content in general. Right. And I guess people just didn't like staying loose for all the time. So in chat in voice chat, people just took it upon themselves to start it up to Lucy, 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 la, 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 Lucy, this, Lucy, that, Lucy, Kenya. All right, whatever. So Rift did the same thing, and a lot of that came in from Rift. And Rift wasn't the first game. I think it was actually World of Warcraft when I went back to it after Rift, uh, where I just started using Lucy, just as just Lucy, just L O O S E I E, like you see on the channel, like I have now. And it was open in every game; nobody had it, so I just decided to use it. And I'm like, since everybody calls me Lucy anyway, I'll just I'll just use that alias, right? Um, and it seems more people like it more confident. Plus, I like the loosey goosey aspect because I do tend to just kind of, you know, I wouldn't consider myself a diehard behind any game. I, I, I just like to enjoy myself. Do I play more than casuals? Well, yeah. Am, am, am I a, a hardcore gamer? I mean, by definition, yeah. But I, I, I try not to let it get, you know, like we all do, let it get too emotional, right? So, um, you know, with that in mind, I guess that's kind of where the story ends. And ever since then, I've just been rolling with that name and it's just kind of kind of stuck. And for any of you who are curious, you know, that's that's where it comes from. And, uh, you know, I, I guess the name I've been using a form of it for, you know, the better part of 20 years, man. You know, so uh, why? Uh, how do they say if, if it ain't broke, don't fix it? Right. So. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know this is kind of a little bit of rant, but it's a little bit about me, you know, and I figured I can kind of introduce you guys to maybe a little bit of kind of the history of me and how long I've been doing this and, you know, just playing games. I mean, um, and I've been a fan of, of games, particularly, you know, MMOs, but just gaming in general. And it's, you know, it's something we all love. And I'm going to keep doing this, trying to get different kind of content. I'm going to get feedback from you guys so I can know what to make, what you want to what do you want to hear? What do what do y'all want to know about? You know, um, that way maybe I can you know share something that 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 could be useful. Who knows? There's something you know uh, entertaining that you, that you guys might like. Whatever, you even get a laugh from. I I don't care. You know, it's 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 for you guys that I do this. So just uh, you know any comments or anything, please leave them down. You know down there below. Thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever. You know, give engagement to the video, and you know let me know if you guys want you know, some more short stories or something like this. Cause I tell you what, when it comes to games and particular ones, I, I, I have, I mean, stories for days and I think they're all pretty damn interesting and funny. So just let me know down in the comments below what you guys think. Don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed it. Please check out one of the reviews. Um, I do have a new world. I don't know if I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna, it's just gonna be new world maybe. And I don't know about the rest of the title because it's going to be a different video. Um, I don't know. I can't really give it a full blown review for what they you, you guys will have to see, I guess, for the video. So we got that coming out the pipes. We have some more vodcast coming down. And I'm again trying to, you know, expand and broaden the content that, that we're going to be covering here. So with that in mind, I'm gonna go ahead and stop rambling and let you guys go. And until next time, I'll see y'all later.